So in just a couple days, administrators, I'm going to be having a live webinar to teach you how to transform your school discipline system with PBIS and restorative practices, three simple steps. So I wanna tell you a little bit about um, a principal that I worked with at a high school, a large high school in California, and she was dealing with vandalism to the extreme in the bathrooms. The, the boys' bathrooms, they were tearing soap dispensers off the wall, um, flushing vapes down, vape cartridges down the toilet, the, all the sewage backed up. At one point, I think they even broke the sinks off the wall. And then the whole thing um, kind of hit a, a crescendo when they had a rave in the bathroom. And so I worked with her to blend PBIS and restorative practices to solve the problem. Together, I helped her put together a large circle that involved the kids that were, were doing it, student leaders, the custodian, the operations director, the administrators, and some teachers. And we ran a restorative conversation. We also implemented a bunch of PBIS strategies to prevent the problem behavior from happening in the first place, to monitor bathrooms and things like that. And so together, all of those things, the problem completely stopped. So I wanna encourage you that by blending the two most widely used student climate and, and behavior programs in the world, if you blend those, you can have really immediate changes that meet the needs of everyone in your school community. So join me starting Monday the 15th. I'm going to be hosting um, the first of a series of live, live webinars. I'll have several spots for different time zones available. So I want you to join me and just learn. You're gonna walk away with a restorative discipline tool kit and I'm going to teach you how to teach your teachers how to make your school different and better so I'll see you there